hello gamers and welcome to this minecraft tutorial video and today i'm going to be showing you how to make a clinton so as you guys know clinton's is a greeting card shop in which you can buy all your gifts and so much more and by the way i'm also going to show you how to make the inside of your clinton's yeah as you can see over here but anyways without any further ado it's time to begin Okay now this is the amount of space that you will need to make your clinton so this is a 21 by 20 block area do feel free to make this Okay now these are all of these materials that you will need and these are all of these materials that you will need to make your clinton please to make sure you have grabbed all of these Okay now step 1, come to the front left hand corner of the grid, then count inwards by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. That is the starting position. As you can see if you count, right, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, this is where we are going to start at the 9th position. Now let me just destroy all these guiding blocks. Yeah, this is where we are going to start. Now place. Place a red concrete on the starting position. Okay, extend this to the right by by five. One, two, three, four, five. Then extend this fifth block up by four. One, two, three, four. Actually, five, not four. And then we extend it to the right by five as well. One, two, three, four, five. In which you have to extend these. Oops, perfect. And then we place three red concrete like this. Then a red concrete, extend this up by five. And then extend this red concrete divided by five. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, oh, I forgot, just forgot to extend these. And let's just do this. I think it should line up. Yeah. Just finish doing this. And I think that's perfect. Yeah. And now we place the four stained, four white stained glass paint. Now this might be tricky to place, but we'll just do it as fast as we can, but in every single hole. I think we may have to add another row of white stained glass. I think yes. Maybe let's try doing this. Oh, no, I don't think so. Yeah, I think we have to add another row like this. But because of the grid. I don't think we are able to do it. Maybe if we can. Can we extend this longer? No, no, I don't think we can. Um. 
shall we leave it as it is guys shall we okay then i guess we can extend all these okay guys this is slightly correction it turns out that i my bad that was my mistake it is not four it's actually three guys nice. i'm so sorry for my mistake trust me uh, i just found literally found it that it was three it was not four at all but yeah sorry about it but anyways we just have to extend all extend those red concretes it's, you have to connect it in the middle like so what am i doing yeah this is going to be the entrance of our clean towns and you have to place like a solid block so that way we can place the end rod now let's try doing this let's do this yeah now we have two end rods in two in the two middle sets of glass panes left and right and yeah these are the door handles now we need a step for that in which we will place smooth quartz stairs on the ground perfect now come to the sides and we have to extend this oh, what have i done oh yeah then we have to extend this red concrete to the right by 10 rows 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 oops 9 10 in which we can extend all the way or like this and just all the way until it's as until it is even and level with this red concrete here in which we can extend this all the way to the front there you go and now we have to make the walls now the walls are go is going to be red concrete actually and the walls are going to be as high as this red concrete here we just connected above the windows and we are oh and we are, going to, we are going to do this to every single side Okay, now that we have done all these, we have to extend these up by 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. In which we can ex extend all these all the way. 
Yeah. We'll notice to all the sides. Okay, now that we have done all these, we are now going to place a trim or smooth coat stress all around and the upper, upper, you know that the last set concrete that we have on the top, this is where we are going to place the smooth, smooth coat stairs and it's going to go exactly all the way through the build. Perfect. And in this sign, and sorry, and in this sign, yeah, this is exactly a sign where we're going to place the word Clintons. Okay. Now, right now, we're going to make the sign. So the sign. So we need a loom for that. Oops. We need a loom for that. Open it up. Then what we're going to make is the word Clintons. So we're going to start with C. So C. A horizontal row of white a red banner sorry red banner and a white die so a horizontal row of white die on top grab it put it in 
horizontal row of white dye at the bottom then a vertical row of white dye to the left which will give you C maybe if we get just get rid of all these it may be easy for us let's try getting rid of all these perfect and I'll just do this okay now next will be L we're gonna have a word let's leave it a vertical row of vertical row of white dye to the right then horizontal row of white dye on the bottom there you go L next is I so I a vertical row of white dye on at the middle horizontal rows of white dye top and bottom I next is N vertical row of white dye left and right then a diagonal row of white dye top left to bottom right which gives you n next is t horizontal row sorry um really we'll have a vertical row of white dye at the middle then a horizontal row of white dye on top t next is o a horizontal row of white dye on top at the bottom vertical row of Vertical row of white dye left to right. You know, when you place a vertical of white dye to the left, then I then it looks like a C, and I just now got two C's, which kind of annoys me. Now, next is like an apostrophe that every that the Clinton's logo had between the N and S. Yeah, I think uh, uh, the word with an apostrophe may look better. Oh, and by the way, we next would be N, but we already have one so. We'll skip that and we'll move on to the apostrophe in which we've all we just did it. Next is S horizontal row of white dye top and bottom. Yeah, then a diagonal row of what what then a diagonal row of white dye from top left to bottom right. S now you have clean toss, which is not exactly the right word. I mean because we have an N over here. Yeah. So the C is going to be placed. It's it's going to be under this middle row of white stained glass pane on the second row, then on the second one, which will be C L I N T O N apostrophe S. There you go, Clintons. There you go. Hmm. Do we have to center this? Let's see whether if we can center this. Is there a bottom row? What about here? Yeah, I think this is looking better now. Yeah, this is looking better. Now we can get rid of that loom. And yeah, we'll do the car park later. Now, the inside. Now for the inside. I'm going to grab all the materials and then we can move on. Okay guys, I just grabbed all the inside materials. And yeah, these are all of these materials that you will need. And yeah, let's begin. First, this, the roof. Already done the, I think it's called as a roof. This is the roof, but this is a ceiling, my bad. I've finished doing the roof of this red concrete here. Because I forgot about this, they didn't notice. But yeah, let's finish doing this.
think I think it is better to add torches. So that way we can see. Yeah. Perfect. And then we just finish this. I think we're almost done. Just two or two gap you have to fill. And then here. Oh, where was I? So just this. Oops. Guys, it's a little dark here. Yeah, it's a little dark and I was no and I wasn't able to see. But I'll just, but I'll try my best to finish this. Yeah. Finally now now that it now that these this is done. You're not going to add a load of sea lanterns. Yeah, we just have to destroy this middle middle part of this red concrete here that we have for the for, for that we have for that ceiling. Just finish this. Okay, now we just have to fill this in using sea lanterns. This will illu this will illuminate more light inside our Clintons or Clintons or whatever you pronounce. I rather pronounce it Clintons inside of our Clintons. yep there you go now next we're going to make the counter so the counter very very easy we start with a three three row gap here then we place 10 rows of red concrete one two oops that's two not three yeah that's a three row gap it should be one two three four four five six seven eight nine ten then you extend this red concrete right by one a gap of one then a red concrete in which we have to extend this all the way good then add a row of quartz slabs yeah add a row of quartz slabs 
like so then some bookshelves oops just finished doing this okay and i actually forgot the smooth coasters uh, let me grab that for a second and the smooth coasters is going to be its cash register like this then some red carpet over there what oh, i should mention does this, this labs are some shelves yeah and now you have to add bookshelves so the bookshelves very easy it's just going to line up with that that middle that middle row of oops, white stained glass pane as you call and then some bookshelves yeah i think that's okay maybe even here as well perfect and now then just fill this using quartz smooth coaster slabs and a smooth coaster slabs is going to be its main shelf as well yeah just what we have in that in this counter here yeah and we're going to place and oh it's going to be in all the sides and unfortunately i cannot i can't place it in here because it will block the people to enter but i can only do it from there yeah in which we can place some carpets the carpet shows you where to go like this it's not here well, let me place the carpet in front of the entrance like where it's going to lead to yeah then from here then just finish doing this nice now the final thing that we are going to make is the floor so the floor is going to be oak so, oh, so the floor is going to be oak wood planks but oops i accidentally destroyed that glass pane here sorry about this get this here the oak planks but yes as i was saying as i was saying we're going to fill the floor in using oak planks but you can use any kind of material i rather prefer oak wood planks but again you guys can use any other material for the floor Okay, now that we have filled in the flooring using oak wood planks. Oops. 
okay now that have now that we have filled in filled in the floor using awkward planks then we are now going to focus on the outside since we are done we are going to add the pavement and some flowers if we could get this white concrete here just remove this white concrete here oh. then this place this here oops what am i doing yeah good and then here as well then remove this and poppies yeah or any kind of flower you want i chose to go with poppies because it kind of like matches with that build as well perfect yeah i should mention i think we can get rid of all these since we are done with those and we'll never see them again yeah for the pavement we need gray concrete white concrete some smooth stone and some poppies oops what am i doing so poppies yeah these kind of will do then just dig all these grass here like so okay okay and this and the smooth stone is going to just so it's, it's this is, i mean this is going to be the same length as the flowers like that we, like we have here just place this yeah perfect now we can make some car park so the car parks is easy just six white concretes concrete three gray white concrete three grays white concrete then then just the white concrete only maybe maybe some okay then one two three four five then here yeah, five will do then white concrete three gray concrete concrete then the white um i don't okay should we line up with that should we line up with that smooth stone over here the last one i think we can yeah yeah then uh, one two three four then five yeah, i think five can do and then just shuffle all these yeah perfect yeah i think this will do oh god great just do this okay you know what? let's leave it as it is yep yeah i do know we can leave as it is know what we can do with all these yeah that's okay and then we just have to fill sorry dig this in like so maybe the entire thing like this
okay now we are done now we can now for now we can now like take a tour of our clintons in which i'm i will do it after i finish clean removing the numbers okay now this is what your clintons will look like once that's been 100 fully completed yeah that's all that is today Sorry, I, I didn't upload during Christmas. I was busy yesterday, but here I am back with this Christmas special. And yeah, if you want to check out my City Builds tutorial playlist, find the link down in the description below. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.